And after being stuck without shows for more than a year, News Channel reporter Blake Devine spoke to performers who are thrilled to step back into the spotlight. After the pandemic put its performances on pause for 16 months, Circus Vargas has brought its big top back to Santa Barbara. We are psyched to be back. Um, and I hope that the audience feels the same way, finally getting to see live entertainment and we get to do what we love. The fun family activity features plenty of performances, magic, and a flying trapeze experience. For Jada Natali, this is her first trip to the circus. We were just wanted to have a fun family outing, and it was a surprise for me and my cousins. Even though they were stuck without shows, these performers kept preparing for this moment. We've been practicing for the past year and a half, um, but just on our own with no audience, so it's so great to finally perform for people in person. This year's show honors the late Clifford Vargas, who founded the circus way back in 1969. You see him first as a little kid coming to the show, falling in love with the circus, and then he comes back later as a, as a grown adult owning Circus Vargas. We hope this inspires other young children to you know, keep coming to the circus and maybe do something with the circus or become circus owners, but we definitely want to keep this circus alive. Good. Sitting in their seats watching true talent, the show presents an opportunity to make memories again. It's getting to share this experience together, have a memory like after COVID, we got to go see the circus. Circus Vargas is performing at Earl Warren Showgrounds up until July 19th. In Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter Blake Devine.